We are a little team, we are unique to British Gas. I would describe us as custodians of the lamps. People don't realise there's gas lights still across Westminster. There's 1,480 of these lamps. From 1813, we've been looking after the lamps under the Gas Light and Coke Company, which is now British Gas. To get to the lamp themselves, they need a ladder. If you're walking about the streets of London, you might see a ladder chained to a gas lamp. When you put a set of ladders up in London, folks stop. And they're fascinated by the job that we do. We set the time of day the lamp comes on and goes off and, yeah, we wind them up every 14 days. We get more and more requests now from architects who are wanting to modernise a building. The architects are adding in more of those original features which become the gas lamp, so you're getting a nice modern building looking old with a modern gas lamp. It's basically traffic that so we get a lot of problems with, with the lamps when they get broken. And what we tend to do is take that lamp away, get it repaired, put it back, Sometimes put them back and leave them bent. If we keep putting it back, it's going to keep getting smashed. We take some underprivileged children round on a tour and we took them into a place called Goodwin's Court, which is very Dickiness. It's got the bow windows. A lot of the, the movie teams will go there. And so we've got a lamp there. I've got three lamps here, but the lamp in the corner is the film in, uh, from Harry Potter where he was given his wand, which I think is, is Diagon Alley. We lovingly cherish these lamps every, every day, every week. The guys are out in all weathers maintaining them. You know, they love the job they're doing. As I clean the gas lamps, as I own them, as I put effort into them, as I'm walking away and I look back and I watch them come on, I still, to this day, I think how beautiful do they look. Me personally, you know, I can't think of a better job in the world.